Hey, what's going on guys? This is Fatty. I got a lot of comments in my videos asking how do I mod my keyboard or can I see what's inside of your keyboard? So if this is something that you want to see, stay tuned. Alright, and again, I did not mod this keyboard. It was done by Frank Castle, which you can find his information with the link below. If you guys want to get your keyboards modded, make sure you reach out to them. So without further ado, let's see what's inside my keyboard. So here's my keyboard. Put the custom Brook sticker on there. We're going to start by and removing these screws. So there's one screw right here, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 screws to remove to open this case. This is a Corsair Strafe Mechanical Gaming Keyboard. So we're going to get started. Alright, so once you got all the screws out, just flip it over. And then this case from here, you just gotta pry out this little tab right here. Once you get the covers off, all you gotta do is remove it on like that. And this is what literally holds your keyboard in place. So once you get the covers off, there's these other small screws that's holding your keyboard in place. You got one, two, three, four, five, six. So you got six small screws that you gotta unscrew. So let's get those off. And before we actually take this off, I want to show you guys something. Notice that there's two caps missing. The reason why is because my jab, which is this one right here, has gone out a couple of times. So I just took these keys and replaced it. So it went out twice already. So as you guys know, I only use these buttons right here and all the rest are dead keys. So you got unlimited supplies of switches that you can remove from any one of them and replace these one if these went out. Quick tip for you guys, so you don't have to worry about going out and buying buttons. That's why keyboards are awesome. Alright, so now that you have all the screws removed, now for the awesome and what you guys have been waiting for. How this thing is modded. So let's flip this over. So it just lifts right up and we're going to turn this around. So this is the brains of the operation. So this is the Brooks PS3, PS4 Fight Board. This is the device that you use to play on your PS4. This is what your PS4 recognizes. And this is what's tournament legal. This board right here is dead. We are not using this board from the factory keyboard. 
So this is what make it illegal, legal, illegal, legal. This acts like a fight stick and this is what makes it recognizable in your PS3 and your PS4 and PC. How it's wired is if you look at the board itself, notice that these are soldered. So I don't know if you guys can see, but you see R1, R2, cross, circle, square. These are your actual buttons in your punches and kick. Right here is your directionals. See, up, down, left, right. And these buttons right here, it's like your option for your PS4, share button and so on. Each wires are soldered down. The positive are all right here. And it's gonna be ground. So you do need a positive and ground. And going over to the switches, each of these switch have a positive and a negative. So this wire right here is my up, down, left, right. And these are all the punches and kicks buttons. Up here, I utilize the start button, the option button, and the share button. And this is where the power source is going to. So it's wired into the USB terminal. And that's what connects to your keyboard and your PS4. And that is wired to the Brook Converter. And all the rest of the switches aren't being used. Only the ones that I want him to use are soldered down. So there you guys have it. So unfortunately I wasn't able to flip the Brook Converter around because he actually glued it down. So unfortunately I won't be able to show you guys on the other side on how it was wired. But I hope that gave you a good idea on how to wire your own keyboard. Um, if you do have any questions, feel free to reach out to Frank or any other modders who knows how to mod keyboards or mod Spicek. Uh, it's pretty much relatively the same concept. It's just that you're doing a different platform. Feel free to message me. Feel free to put a comment below. Ask me what you want to see next. And I'll see if I can try to make a video for that for you. Till then, peace out.